We want to revisit the case right now of Suzanne Morphew. She's the woman missing in Chafee County. The 49 year old disappeared Sunday after investigators say she went out for a bike ride. She hasn't been seen since. On the phone with us now we have her nephew Trevor Noel. He is going to talk about what's going on with this case. Trevor, good morning. Good morning. I know you've been in the midst of the search uh, for her. Uh, tell us what's going on now as far as you and the search crews and the family are concerned. Sure. Um, every morning early we've been gathering and creating a game plan and we just sent a bunch of teams out. We have our biggest crew yet today going out again. Um, and we're working all day from when the sun comes up until the sun comes down scouring every hill, every creek, every watershed looking for our beloved family member and my aunt Suzanne. I know it must be really difficult. Is there is there any clue as to what might happen? Are there any theories that you're working on? Yes, there are, but um, I think it's best for the investigation and for the family and for the progress that we that we uh, keep it uh, keep it close um, and maybe not discuss it live right now, but we're making progress and we are so far from giving up and we are going to find her today. <sighs> okay, I will do that. I will honor that. Uh, tell us a little bit about Suzanne. What was she like? I think the question was to tell you a little bit about Suzanne. Yes. And she is the sweetest, most loving person. Um, she's my aunt and the most wonderful, loving beautiful person inside and out and we need her back to us now. I know that there's been a reward uh, offered by the family and also a friend of the family. Uh, talk a little bit about that if you can. I, I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Uh, yeah, we're breaking up. I know it's, it's difficult. Uh, talk a little bit about the reward that is being offered if you can. Yes. So Barry, Suzanne's husband, has put out a reward of $100,000 for her safe return with no questions asked. And a generous family friend has matched his offer. So we have $200,000 that we'll offer for Suzanne's safe return, no questions asked. All right, and is there anything that you would like to ask the viewers to do? Any information yes. that you would like to get out there? Yes, please. I would implore the viewers, everyone, please go to Facebook and visit the page, Find Suzanne Morphew, facebook.com slash Find Suzanne Morphew. We also have information about our GoFundMe page on the About section of the Facebook page. And the tip line is the most important. If you see anything, if you hear anything, if you saw anything suspicious from Sunday on until now, anywhere in the state, anywhere that you are, please call the tip line, 719-312-7530. And I know the search is going to continue today. You talked about that, but what's, what's the game plan as far as uh, taking the search into the weekend? Um, we're going everywhere. We have teams going into, into towns and into remote mountainous areas and every place in between, scouring the area, looking for any clue, and that's the game plan. And to... And, you know, we're gathering together at the end of each day or as we can throughout and compiling everything that we find and building a stronger, building a stronger plan for the next day and going out um, with a, a more coordinated effort. Well, Trevor, I can't imagine what you and the rest of the family are going through. I want to thank you for uh, joining us this morning and uh, bringing us up to date. And uh, please keep us up to date if you can, okay? I sure will. Thank you for helping, get us, helping us get the word out. Okay. All right. Trevor Noel, thank you much. Thank you.